They say styles make fights, but when masterful technique meets devastating power, the end result is always the same. Someone's going down. Mixed martial arts has taken the US by storm. Gyms across the UK have latched onto this, teaching fighters everything from judo to boxing. We took a look at Top's gym in Wakefield. Former Mr UK Steve Johnson has been a long admirer of the sport and sees a big future here in Britain. Well, the opportunity that came along, uh, the Rich Taylor, who was actually taking the classes at the moment, he was looking for somewhere to do the classes, and it was something certainly wanted to introduce, as uh, it is the largest growing sport in the world. Uh, nothing has ever exploded on the scene like Bits Martial Arts, and it's uh, potentially the biggest sport uh, on the planet in a few years to come. This is the co-main event of the evening! Danny Humphreys has just come from an intense session. Uh, I've been doing it for about four months now, so yeah, I'm still quite new to it. Oh, it's a fantastic workout. I don't think you can get any better, to be fair. Um, you're working pretty much every part of your body, doing all core work, obviously upper body strength, your punching and everything. Um, fitness, you know, again, you can't really get any better than that. Co-owner Jimmy Gittens is impressed with the turnout so far. Um, we've only really been running it for the last three weeks and we run it at capacity every time. Uh, you know, the lads the lads come down and they commit themselves for an hour. I mean, it's, I've watched it myself tonight for the first time and it's, it's pretty full on, it's pretty physical. Rich Taylor has been a professional for eight years and trains the fighters and is a strong believer of its success in the UK. I support, uh, go back five years, everybody classed cage fighting as thuggery. Uh, these days people are willing to give it a bit more of a chance, uh, realising that you know, with, with likes of Ultimate Fighter and, and people are actually showing what fighters are doing to get into shape and they're not all just a bunch of idiots. Uh, I've been teaching a pro team for uh, about eight years. So come down doing an extra couple of sessions here to uh, to get some of his lads up. Mainly I think they're interested in the wrestling side of it because uh, it's one of the best like physical culture exercises that you can do. Uh, develops a lot of power and strength. So I think that's the main reason. They're all fans of MMA and wanting to uh, get a bit of uh, get a bit of experience in it as well. Could the latest phenomenon here in the UK be MMA? We will have to wait and see. <laughs> Yeah, right. So when you did it, he 